Well guys, right now, today is April the 8th, 2024, and we are about to uh, have a celestial encounter that we haven't really had, at least not where I'm at, since uh, 2017. If you want to know exactly what I'm talking about and what that is, stick around, because the Vojek experience starts right now. <music> Welcome back to another video of the Vocek Experience, where idiots are still always us. Always me. And of course, I'm going to be an idiot because I'm going to be looking up at the sky, hopefully trying not to go blind. And yes, if you've guessed what I'm saying, and of course you probably already know because you probably read the title before you clicked on the video, uh, this video is all about the, uh, the solar eclipse that's going to be taking place today actually pretty soon really um and uh which is why i'm outside which is why i'm out here in my yard which is why i got sunglasses on too because you know uh the less damage to my eyes the better <laughs> but uh but the purpose of this video is to try to get some kind of video record or pictures whatever some kind of record of the solar eclipse that's going to be coming I'm not exactly sure how it's going to be or how good it may be uh, because it is pretty cloudy and but uh, the sun does peek through uh, every so often from the clouds and I'm hoping that we see something pretty good uh, today so uh, so yeah uh, I'm just waiting for all this to happen. Um, I think all in all, the whole thing's supposed to take a couple of hours. Um, but, uh, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I, um, I did get, uh, some pictures from, uh, from, uh, 2017 when we had a solar eclipse back then. But, uh, I'm hoping now today... Uh, might get a little bit better pictures or video for that matter because uh, you know I have a better camera than I had back then so fingers crossed and uh, and of course hoping that I don't go blind and hope I don't uh, destroy my camera when, when I try to take pictures or video um, but, uh, but yeah I'll do what I can for you but, uh, but all in all total solar eclipse from right here Crescent Pennsylvania and that's coming up right now not much you can really see because um, of the, the clouds uh, and all that stuff uh, but you can see it is cloudy but there is some blue out there that you can see but right now the Sun is pretty much right here where I'm pointing but you can't really see anything because of that big old cloud right there but uh but we're gonna keep looking up and keep getting updated on this thing the uh, sun came out for a little bit and then went back away <laughs> but we're gonna like i said keep you updated all right sun's out there for a little bit but i can't really tell anything at least not yet <laughs> Well, you can kind of see it. I'm not sure how well you can see it on here, but I'm trying to get it. Wow. But I don't think it's coming through too good on the screen. Maybe it will once it gets even more covered. We'll see how it goes. 
Yeah, I've seen that moon go, and then that's where it was. Yeah, but still can't really get it on the camera. At least not yet, anyhow. Nope, it's going into that big bright spot right there. Yeah. I mean, me personally, I can see it, but uh -huh. I think the light is still so bright, it's blinding out, you know, uh -huh, I can see the it. camera. All right, of course, as soon as I start the video again, it goes away. Yeah, well, just keep going, there it is. Oh, I kind of see it in the video. It's like a there it is. There it is. And then, now I can't see it because it's... It's out from the clouds <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> but hopefully i'll see it again once it goes back but it's getting there yeah it's, it's getting there. there it's almost there oh right yeah there i can see it in the video and then it goes away again so it's like it pops it. in there for like a couple seconds and then it goes away <laughs> but <laughs> Days. Maybe I'll start taking Daisy everywhere. I doubt it, but you know. Every dang time I start the video, it goes out from it. the dark part of the cloud and then you can't see it again. <laughs> I haven't been able to see it for a while. There it is. Now, well, you kind of see it there. It's getting like a, there. Look at that. It's a little thumbnail now again. You can really see it when it goes by the dark clouds there, but you can mm -hmm. see it. Sun's almost completely covered there. You see that? That's pretty cool. getting there <laughs> slowly but sure mm -hmm. and it's getting a little dark out here too is it it's yeah darker. I can tell when I take my sunglasses off it is getting dark yeah it's getting a little darker out yeah yeah that is just so freaking cool though it's the way it's moving it looks like it's moving so fast. Yeah, but that's really the clouds moving, not the sun. But that is just so Ooh, freaking cool. It's going back in the clouds. I can see it again. Kind of. And it's come back out from the cloud. Oh, I think, yeah, you have to be looking right up there. Yeah. <laughs> this is probably the best as we're going to get it for the eclipse. Because we're definitely not in the zone for a complete total total. Yeah. It's like when it goes into the clouds, you can see it. And then when the clouds aren't so dark, then you can't see it. There is it, it is again. Smaller or bigger? I can't really tell. Because I really can't see. <laughs> but yeah, I think this is the best we're going to get it though. Unfortunately. But I will say this is cool though. Can't really see it there because that's a really, really dark cloud. <laughs> I can't see anything. Get a little jet plane action here. <laughs> Since we're looking up at the sky. <laughs> what was that? Getting that little jet that's up there. <laughs> Alright guys, this is probably going to be the last shot that I attempt to get of the Eclipse here. Just because, you know, I don't think we're going to see much more. Especially with the clouds and all that stuff. 
because it looks like the moon is now moving away and it's starting to get a little lighter out here again so yeah well guys there you have it that's about the best i can do for the the eclipse um uh, I knew we wasn't going to get a complete 100% total, you know, eclipse because of where Crescent is in the path of the the whole thing. But I was able to get some pretty good shots, you know, especially when the, the darker clouds came through, you know, and dimmed some of the sunlight a little bit. So um, I wish I could have done better, but that's about as best we can do for the eclipse. Um, but for those of you uh, watching this, if you were in an area where you did get a, a total 100% uh, you know, eclipse and you know, 100% total of the, the whole you know, thing getting dark and everything, let me know in the comments because I would love to hear about it. If you have pictures, you please you know, feel free to share in the comments and all that stuff. But, uh, but for now, that's going to be about it for this video. Um, so uh, if you enjoy this video, seeing the eclipse as best as I could have done, uh, hit that subscribe button, give me a thumbs up, and hit that notification bell so you get notified of future videos. And, uh, and of course, if you want to support this dumb little channel of mine, hit that join button, become a member of the Idiot Squad because we'd love to have you. And of course, you can also support the channel by uh, donating to Cash App. And you can just scan that little QR code that's on the thing. Like I said in other videos, you don't have to do it. It's just a suggestion. Um, but, uh, and of course, uh, you can follow me on all the major social medias if you'd like. And uh, uh, I know I'm missing something. Ah, merch store. Yeah, check that out if you haven't done that yet. Uh, all those links are, they're all down below. <laughs> But, uh, but I know uh, for some of you, uh, depending on where you're at, I know the eclipse was probably either a letdown or it was really cool. For me, even though we didn't get 100% total blackout from the, the eclipse, I still thought it was pretty cool because don't really get to see that too much, you know, where I'm at. And uh, as a matter of fact, uh, it's only the second uh, solar eclipse I've seen in person. Uh, in my lifetime and I'm almost 45 years old so hey uh, unfortunately we aren't going to see another one for another 20 years so but uh, but anyway like I said I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, I also hope that you guys you know wherever you are you know I hope you're having a good day good night good week whatever the case is when you're watching this and I will see you all in the next one and until then guess what Bye for now.